Hey guys, Matt here, bringing you the latest in movie reviews. And today, I'm taking a look at The Hobbit, An Unexpected Journey. So who's in this movie? Well, it's got John Watson, Magneto, Heinz Kruger, Catherine Hepburn, Count Dooku, Megatron, Ash, and King Kong. What's it about? Well, it's set 60 years before the events of the Lord of the Rings movies, where we get to see a younger version of Bilbo Baggins, Frodo's uncle. Yeah, you know that old guy in the original movies who didn't really do much? Yeah, he's got his own trilogy now. And after a visit from Gandalf the Grey, Bilbo agrees to go on an adventure with him and 13 dwarves. Whose names are I'll say now? Go! Dwallin, Balin, Feely, Keely, Oin, Gloin, Beefer, Bofer, Balmber, Ori, Dory, Nori, and Thorin. Yes! Woo! I am a huge nerd. And what exactly is the dwarf's quest? to reobtain their kingdom from the dragon known as Smog the Magnificent. So, 13 short guys, a dude with hairy feet who's never been in a fight before, and a wizard who almost never uses magic against a vicious, fire-breathing dragon who easily conquered a dwarf kingdom that calls himself the Magnificent. Yeah, that's a fair fight. But that goal's far on the horizon, as our party must encounter a fantastical journey along the way filled with interesting sights and people. They visit Rivendale, the city of elves. Ah! Oh my god! Not those kinds of elves. If there was an entire city of him, I don't think it would survive. And Bilbo meets up with everybody's favorite schizophrenic ring bearer, Gollum. Precious wants to make a cameo. No, we have a full-fledged role or we walk. But the fences, they loves us. Screw the fences, we want money's precious. And all the while, the party battles orcs and trolls and goblins, oh my, with their array of dwarven weaponry, and Bilbo even gets his own weapon. That's not a sword. That's a sword. So final verdict, 9 out of 10. Peter Jackson has done it again, in creating an epic movie filled with action, adventure, CGI masterpieces, and even a little nostalgia for those who've been wanting a new Lord of the Rings movie. But don't just take my word for it, take it from Matt Review's own personal Middle Earth expert, Legolas. Legolas, what did you think of this movie? I thought it was an excellent cinematic piece. Thanks, Legolas. Although it could have used more of me in it. Thank you, Legolas. And you wouldn't shut up during the entire thing. Thank you, Legolas. On my axe! We get it, Gimli. You have an axe that is so freaking awesome. Unfortunately, we have to wait a whole nother year for the next Hobbit movie, but when it comes out, I'll be right here reviewing The Hobbit, The Desecration of Smog. Huh? The Desolation of Smog. Alright, internet people, all this Hobbit talk has made me want to go on an adventure. See ya. Rorschach, send word to the dwarves. The adventure is on! You mean the Filipino midgets down at the Home Depot? Whatever. Sarah, ready the horses and sharpen my blades! Already done, sir. Excellent! Then onward to back! Oh! <laughs>